Book One, Fifteen. I've often feared much hardship from your levity by Propertius. I've often feared much hardship from your levity, Cynthia, but except su accepted, but accepted such perdiffity as this. See into how much danger fortune rests me. Yet leisurely you come among my fears. You can touch up my yesterday's coiffure and examine your face in long absorption and variegate your breasts with orient gems, like a beauty preparing to meet a new lover. The Ithacans going to going did so move Calypso when once she wept by the unfrequented sea for many days with unkempt lock, locks she sat and mourned, declaring much to the cheating brine. And though she'd never see him more, she grieved nonetheless, remembering long drawn out delights. Not so when the winds bore off Asonides Aeson did Hypslia fix, fixedly stand by her empty marriage bed. Hypslia tasted no more pleasures when once she had wasted away for that Haemonian guest. Alphasobia Alf was avenged for her husband's sake. On her brothers, love broke blood's dear chains. Evandine Evadine, the type of Argive chastity, perished raised on her husband's pitiful fire. Not one of those could reverse your willfulness, that you too might become famous in story. Stop now renewing your lying protestations, Cynthia. Refrain from provoking the gods you forget. O oh, reckless woman, you'll smart at my cost if anything serious chances to pierce you. Nothing more certain, rivers shall flow from the vast sea, the year lead in its seasons in reverse or, reversed order, before my care for you shall change in my breast. Be whatever you will, but not another's. Oh, do hold those eyes so cheap, through which your faithfulness has often gulled me. But by them you swore that if you'd been at all forsworn, they would fall out on your outstretched hands. Then can you lift them to the mighty sun, know your guilty excesses, and not tremble? Tremble? Who compelled you to blench through many hues, to draw out tears from those reluctant lights, for which I now am dying, to warn like lovers? Alas, no blandishments are safe, safe to trust. That is... Book 115, I've often feared much hardship from your levity by Propertius.